just ignore the mess so got the racking up got three out of four exoterras in here this one i've got another one of these so i'm going to swap everything out of this one and stick that one on the end here so they can all share this one uv bulb got to sort all these wires out get them up on the wall nice and neat got the uh, bearded down here so they're doing really well um and then the other ones the hatchlings are going to come down they're going to go here next to it and the tortoises are going to go up there um i've done this enclosure well i haven't i've say i've done it i haven't finished it this is going to be for the basilisks they're going to come in here um i need to get some more greenery and um i need to get a plant light up there um and some more branches um because there's a lot of wasted space around the top here um but yeah so things are coming together uh, yeah so all i need to do is just fix the the wiring make it really nice and neat and tack it all in properly so you've know, just roughly pinned it up yeah so beard is there then i'm going to stick all the substrate and everything under there all the spare substrate um this down here is a nothing this is just a hole now under there um it could be used as an enclosure if i could be bothered to do anything with it um if not um i get a lot of this reptile bark um i get a lot of it in bags so i could just use this as like a coal shed kind of thing for the reptile bark just shove it all in there and then when i need to you know replace and stuff like that, i could just shovel it out and put new in or whatever um i haven't done anything down here yet um only because i can't be bothered and i've run out of materials so this whole section is going to have to wait till after Christmas. We've got power down here and everything, so it's going to have to wait till after Christmas. But so far, I am super happy. The only mistake I made is I put a double shelf unit in for them to go top and bottom. I forgot about my incubator and my freezer. So I'm going to have to build them in somewhere. Not here, because I think I want this as a shelf to do my bits and bobs um so i don't know where they're gonna go yet um they could just stay up in the top shed it's not a problem so yeah but there we go that is the reptile room thus far there's little Aki having a bathe she's had two locusts today i saw her I catch them um there's one chameleon she's heavily gravid this oh there's the other two there's one there, there, and one there. So that one's gravid, and that one is literally ready to drop. She's down there digging a hole. Um, she's been doing it for the past three nights, and then she comes up, has a break, gets some UV, gets a bit of heat on her. You can still see the dirt on her head from where she's been ploughing her head into the soil. So, yeah, she's come up and having a break, and then she, I suppose she's just going to... Go back down there tonight, which is what she normally does, and carry on digging. There's a hole right at the back, and I think she's dug all the way down here. So I think the eggs are going to be around here somewhere. Um, but yeah, so that's it. That's it, guys. Cheers. Till the next time.